one gets to a point in one's life when uh, the bigger questions, you begin to consider the bigger questions. And when I was a kid, you know, I was taught these things. You know, I was brought up in a household that taught Christianity, Christ, Catholicism, and I had a firm grounding in that. And in my refocus or re-examination of everything, the story of the passion came up at me and I kind of used it as a personal meditation. And I was doing a lot of reading on the subject. I kind of thought, well, you know, somebody ought to put this, make a sort of a, a visual record of this. And um, so that's where the idea began, but that was like maybe 14, 15 years ago. I can remember talking to Mel when we first started Icon and we were talking about material and Mel was talking about the Bible. So that's got to be over 15 years ago when he first mentioned the Bible as a source of material for film. It wasn't until till, uh, we were doing We Were Soldiers that he actually uh, expressed any desire to do the film and at that point we were shooting a, a, a big battle sequence out in the middle of Vietnam and then Mel walks off the set and he's standing there and he just comes up next to me you know and I'm, I'm paying attention to something over there and he goes I want to make a movie about the passion. It just kind of emerged at a certain point when it needed to and um, I felt uh, inspired to go off and you know uh, construct a script and, and work with a writer and um, go off and make the film. I was living in Italy at the time, in Umbria, you know, surrounded by olive trees and uh, sort of in Gethsemane, Italian version. And uh, Steve McAfee uh, had told him that he could think of only one or very few writers who could do this for him or help him with it and, uh, and gave him my name. So he called and uh, you know, much to my surprise. And I think the biggest hurdle with Ben was when I, when I was speaking to him was um, he could not understand why I wanted to do it in two dead languages. It was like, it was mystifying to him. I was baffled at the idea. Uh, then it started to grow on me. We talked it through and he got it like bang, the lights went on, he went oh! And he got very excited. And uh, at that point I knew that he was like perfect to collaborate with on the story passion comes from pathos, suffering. That's what it means. You know, we, think, we tend to think of the passion as being another feeling altogether, or another series of feelings altogether, but that's what it means, the suffering. And what we tried to do was to present the account of the passion uh, as it is in the four Gospels. The Gospels themselves are synoptic. That means that they're synopses of what happened. Or there's three synoptic and one John. There are moments in, in this film that are not from the Gospels. Um, one very powerful moment that is not in the Gospels, but is in the book of Revelations, is when we see her run to him on the second fall uh, after his head has been crushed by the weight of the cross. And Jesus runs his fingers over his mother's face and says to her, you see, I, I make all things new. Oh, I take a line from the apostles further on and bring it into the present. And it was, uh, he made all things new, so that that's not strictly in the, you know, passion section of the Gospels. But uh, apart from that, very little deviation from the, um, from the synoptic Gospels. Hey, Amos. Hila, quest. Quis. Villa. Villa Mata Galilei. Vamos. Ayuda. Incelente. 